Thank you very much, Diana. Hello, University Place Presbyterian. Hello. Good morning. Thank you very much for having me this morning. I would like to point out my wonderful wife, Nora, right here in the front. Can we hear it from Nora? She's kind of my favorite person. I like her so much that I married her. And uh, we've been married for five years, and we still like each other. At this point, we've been out on the road for four and a half months from North Carolina, and we still like each other. <laughs> uh, I wanted to see if, if y'all would like to hear Amazing Grace this morning. I, I'd love to play Amazing Grace. Amazing Grace is the best song in the world. And it's, it's my favorite song in the world because it transcends all boundaries, because everybody sees grace on a daily basis, whether they realize it or not. I've seen a lot of grace in my own life. I started my music career back in 2010, and I was living in Williamsburg, Virginia at the time. And I found in 2010 that I could either play guitar full time, or I could keep an apartment. I couldn't do both those things. <laughs> so I, I decided I'd ditch the apartment, and I'd live out of my car, and I'd travel up and down the East Coast playing music every night. And I called it touring, but really I was just playing in whatever dingy bars or venues would have me, and lots of open mics on my many nights off. I did that for a year. And it's amazing to see how much God takes care of you when you do something stupid. <laughs> but in that year, I saw kindness from so many people, and a lot of grace from God. I was kept safe on many long drives. People invited me into their home, cooked for me and they put me up. I never got serial killed. <laughs> but the whole experience did a lot to restore my faith in humanity and what God is able to do through human kindness. Because You have to remember that when you show love, or you show kindness to another one of God's children without expecting anything in return, that's God working through you. Where he extends grace to you every day through his son, Jesus Christ. But he also gives you opportunities to pass grace on to others just by being nice to people. I, I think it's very beautiful, the idea of getting to be part of God's work like that. And so this is amazing grace. And I do want to clarify that I don't make my wonderful wife, Nora, live in the car with me. That was a long time ago. We've since upgraded to a minivan.